Right, today, Olympia Leisure here in sunny Scarborough. There's the sun. Let's not get run over. Uh, right here. Now, I'm not sure, but I think it was the place that used to have DDR fifth mix back in 2005. So, a long, long time ago. There's three floors of bowling at the top. Uh, let's see what they have today. It's, uh, it's been a long time since, since we've been in here. So a lot of, you'll see a lot of these two theme machines here, dotted around. That's like the UK's version of Redemption. But we also have Redemption as well, so. You can uh, bet on a horse for 10p. Try your luck in the uh, slot machines here. There's a lot of cranking. Let's see what the prizes are like. Jurassic World. Baby Yoda, banana. Okay, the uh, prizes aren't too bad. Let's see. So we got a VR setup here. Look, I've seen a lot of these around the UK at the moment. You pretty much pay two pounds and do a VR thing. Here it looks like uh, like a crystal maze kind of thing, where you catch all the balls, perhaps. Uh, it's a big arcade. Uh, I mean. The main floor is dominated by 2P machines. They're everywhere. That's pretty typical though. And uh, yeah, the edge is littered with uh, brain games too. There are three floors, like I said. We have upstairs and the bowling alley as well, which we'll look at. There's the photo booth. They have a mini rider too, look, recreating reality. Let's have a look in here. A little cozy, isn't it? Two pounds for a ride. Here they have a DDR-X2. Unfortunately, it's a really bad, uh, very bad cabinet. You gotta take off all these screws just to look at the pads. And the pads are shit, so uh, definitely not worth playing on. Um, if they just spend a little more money, we'd have something really good, but it doesn't seem to be the case. So there's a boxer in the corner. Uh, more pretty goods. There's a lot of gamblers all down the sides of the walls. I guess the idea is the kids play in the middle, uh, the, maybe the parents kind of gamble. Mario Kart DX, Luigi's Mansion Arcade. So there'll be a lot of these things as well. Uh, the major prize there that's worth about a pound. Uh, Sega Rally Free. Check this out. So they have a half car setup. Pretty good. You don't usually see that actually, that's quite nice. Got a Jurassic Park here, more gamblers, uh, Space Invaders, Walking Dead. So this one's kind of catering to. Uh, a bit towards video games, they're making some sort of effort. They're not sort of totally sold on redemption. We got a Dark Escape 4D as well. Uh, here in the corner, look, a Tesco trolley. Oh, what's that doing here? Who knows? But Tesco, a trolley is here. Uh, Super Bikes 2 and Dead Heat. Here we got the gambling bingo. It's totally fixed, but you know. Uh, Pac-Man look, Zingy. That's a very similar thing to uh, more two Ps. There's the there's the change machine and uh, basketball. 
so yeah we've done all that let's go over Let's see if we don't get a... so when you record in uk arcades um even though they can have thousands of cameras recording you they just have this bee in their bonnet about people recording i don't, I don't know what it is it's like we'll come out the at the 90s or something but yeah it's just one of those things but But sometimes uh, people don't mind. It's, it's really random how that works. But, uh, yeah, it's what it is. Grand piano keys. A full piano. Safari Ranger. That's in the UK, yeah, with it being American football. But, yeah. So here's some of the uh, kind of shoot games where you throw balls. Um, so this is quite cool, the, the theme of the chairs. Uh, crazy Tower. some of the doors here okay so it looks like we're back where we started uh, let's try the stairs maybe there's something uh, maybe there's something upstairs we haven't seen yet oh, and there is something we haven't seen uh, connect four hoops I must have uh, missed that one so there's the stairs we're gonna go up there and take a look but uh, yeah this is the rest of the downstairs Oh, there's a Minecraft Dungeons arcade there. So yeah, so let's go check it out. So let's take a look upstairs. So upstairs we have like a, a horseshoe. It goes around. And the price shops here as well, where you can uh, cash in your hard-earned tickets and things. Um, all right, check it out, though. Rainbow Riches Racing. You can uh, race your leprechaun. We have to gamble first. So uh, let's have a look. The greedy gods. There's some basketball here. Let's see what else. It's only mini, mini basketball. So uh, oh, here's a mini crane game. So uh, yeah, so that's where you get your prizes and everything here. Let's see what's over here. So over the edge we can look at downstairs and see the arcade here. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Here's a little exit if you just need a breather. You can get up to the bowling up there. It's a air hockey. A oh, lot of air hockey. A uh, little punching thing and kids go parts. Yeah, mostly kind of ticket related things. So let's have a look over here. It's got this fidget spinner thing. You can spin. That's funny. Uh, so. Yeah, a little pepper pig. So not much down here. There's uh, pool tables, more air hockey, kind of bumper car things. A uh, couple of 
couple of gamblers, but that's about it here. So let's go to the last floor. They've designed this in such a way that you take the escalators up, and if you want to get back down, uh, you got to do the stairs, or maybe there's a hidden lift. But they have a kind of Marvel uh, cafe here. Look. look at that. It's cool, isn't it? So upstairs there's just more kind of air hockey and a couple of other games. How can I shy? Sonic basketball. Another fire escape. They like their fire escapes. So. But you see, in order to get down, you got to take the stairs. Now, I'll show you the one thing that lets this place down. It's the one thing. It's so stupid, it doesn't make any sense. And it's not the bowling, they have bowling, but the one thing that lets it down is you have to pay to go toilet, 20p. Like, do they really need 20p that badly when they're getting meals? No, I don't think so. But yeah, that's about it, really. So now we're gonna take all the stairs back to the start. And that is it, so uh, thank you for watching. And I hope you enjoyed it.